Hello everybody. This is just to say I'm doing a lot of jobs today because tomorrow I go in for a minor surgical procedure to my neck and look the alpaca are chasing the sheep. This is a medical procedure that I've waited a period of time to get done and basically it has to do with about in 2016-17 I herniated four discs in my neck from a very minor accident that when I was clearing up a hurricane storm damage I hit my head and cracked my neck and for a number of years I was in excruciating pain and that's one of the reasons why I had to stop riding horses and breaking and training horses because having herniated discs in your neck uh, is not advisable to ride a horse particularly if you're breaking green ones and schooling green horses which can suddenly buck so for the last number of years I've been having physiotherapy I had MRIs which is how they discovered I had four herniated discs in my neck and they were for many years giving me migraine headaches and all kinds of other things and my left arm would go numb and it would um, not be able to carry anything for periods of time. So this has been for a number of years. So tomorrow morning I'm finally going in for a very minor procedure that is a, um, oh dear I can't remember what it's called, but basically it's a platelet procedure in that they draw my blood, they spin it centrifugally which separates the white blood cells, the red blood cells, and the platelets. Then they re-inject the platelets into my herniated disc, disc neck area. And hopefully this will heal it and alleviate a lot of the pain that I've been in for about two years at the beginning. I had no sleep, very little sleep. So it's been a very difficult number of years and I've still been farming through it. Um, the MRI that I heard had earlier this spring, I think it was in March, showed that two of the herniated discs had healed because of the physio that I'd been having for the last five years or six years or however many years that is. Uh, so two of them had healed and one was getting almost back in and then the third one, the fourth one was still an issue and that's what we're treating, is getting treated tomorrow to finally fix the um, whole procedure. So today I'm organizing it. My sister's here to help as I recover uh, because I probably won't be able to lift a bucket of water or anything for a period of, I'm not sure if it's how many days it is or how many weeks, but um, then hopefully the procedure will work. It's a modern procedure I think it's been internationally used on humans for the last 10 years here in Ireland for six years and it used to be or still is used on horses to fix wounds and things like that uh, in their anatomy uh, like performance horses it's helped performance horses I have Inca help, sitting here with me and the puppy's still there so um, so hopefully this pre procedure will really work, but I basically haven't told anybody any of this information online because, well, I didn't really want to talk about, you know, a painful problem that I've been dealing with for the last number of years because it's, it's me, it's my business. But just in case anything goes wrong tomorrow. It won't, I'm sure it won't. I'm sure I'll be fine. But when you mess with the neck and the spinal cord, you never know. So I basically want to give you a word in advance that this procedure is occurring. I am hopeful that it will resolve the issue of my neck, my pain, my constant headaches. Well, they're not constant anymore, but they used to be very regular. I used to have migraines like two or three times a week for the first two years of this injury. Um, but I uh, kept shtum about it because, uh, well, basically it's 
my personal business, but I just wanted to post this video to let you know about the procedure that's happening. Yes, I have concerns. Anybody would when your neck is being messed with, but I should probably be okay. So fingers crossed, all goes well, and I'll be back doing videos. At least I'll be able to do videos and walk around, hopefully, after tomorrow's procedure. Uh, I won't be able to do any kind of physical work. I might be able to do a little tiny bit of weeding or something. I'm being covered in puppies now. So hopefully, yes, and I have family and friends who are all kicking in to help uh, uh, as I recover from this procedure. But um, fingers crossed it all goes well. Uh, I will post videos today and photographs and Twitter and uh, today and tomorrow I will be in the hospital having hopefully a healing procedure. And then I can get back to farming with nature and doing the things I love with the animals that I love. Isn't that right, Inka Dink? Yeah. Yes, a pup. Yes, and you too. And you too. And my sister is so pleased with her pup. She's been loving her pup. Okay, guys. Good luck. Stay safe. Be at peace. And enjoy what you have in life. Thank you for all your help and following and helping out on the Patreon account. Bye for now.